Okay, hello everybody. I'm back again with more Tears of the Kingdom. I got it now. I'm 100% sure I got it now. I did have to look up just in case to see if I was missing any of the sky, uh, sky shrines. I was. I was missing one right here. And I was able to notice that I was missing this one. And then I learned there's a few that I went to but did not actually complete. Because I was looking through this and wondering what in the world is this yellow part here. I was wondering if those were shrines where I didn't get the treasure. But I have plenty of them that I did get the treasure in. So I was thinking it couldn't have been that. So I did see that these indicate that they're shrines that I've at least activated, but maybe did go into or didn't finish. So, yeah, <laughs> that should be my four shrines right there. <sighs> All right. <laughs> uh, which looks like it'll be the close. I want to do the Sky Island first. I want to get the Sky Shrine. And I think it might be closer over here if I can jump onto this one and then float there. I still have plenty of uh, Zonite that uh, one plane should get me there. I would assume. We'll find out though. But yeah. And again, I might be doing this for no other reason than I'm getting as much health and stamina as I possibly can. But you know what? That's fine, too. So I wanna... Oh, that's it. Oh, that's like a castle in the sky. That's kind of cool. How the heck am I getting to it? <laughs> Ooh, that island also looks kind of close to it. Could I float there with... no. However, I do like that that's fair, that looks fairly close. Let's have that on just in case. Actually, I do have these two pieces. Let's put that on. I need a steering stick. Right. I think my best bet is to aim for there, at least first. Maybe I have enough to get up there. I don't know. I'll head to my beds and head for the smaller island because I can still make something to help me get up there. Even if I can't uh, uh, get up there with the plane, I should be able to get up 
high enough and close enough where I can use the Zora armor to get up there and maybe the dirigible to get the height that I need. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, man. Oh, see, at the very least, <coughs> pardon me, um, at the very least I'm close enough where I should just be able to go up this waterfall to get higher, to get up there. Let's get as high and as far as we can. Alright, we're good enough, good enough to get at least this. Good, good, good. Scared away the fairy, you jerk! I don't have any. Don't even really want the bow, I wanted any arrows we might have had. Okay, I can at least get this one, maybe, hopefully. Oh! There's another one there. I remember I accidentally used a couple. Okay, got one. Very close. Okay. You know what? I don't even have to really make anything because I can use this to hit on up. Only has the Korok at the top. Alright. Head down a layer, see what's here. Oh, what the frick? That's some Mission Impossible stuff right there. Let's try 
try going another level lower. There was another lower level, right? Uh oh. Uh, to the O. Oh. oh no, did I miss up? I may have messed up? I don't know with this. Oh, nearby down below. So it's in this one. Maybe. Different things. Multiple grates that are closed. Oh, there we go. There it is. Alright. Well, that's the one I need to go to. Let's look at these other ones at least. I might have more Korok stuff. I don't know. There's just Koroks all over the place here. Oh, there. What? No. Oh, that's lava? Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. I want to do this, but I also want to do that. the Zora armor anymore. Alright. Let's see what's up with this. Other side? Mm. 
Okay, so let's just go up. Zonite Forge Island. Oh, is the other piece of my Zonite armor gonna be here? Maybe. if this just hurts or what I made it oh no 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 <laughs> I forgot I don't take fall damage with this <laughs> oh gosh okay <clears throat> goodness pardon me I need to drink more water Oh gosh, darn it. <laughs> Shrine of Prisons and Purifies Ancient Evils. Low. Oh, that's fine. Low gravity? I'm just now learning about low gravity. No, it's mine!
<laughs> Again, at least it, these are much easier now that I have the hearts for it. <laughs> Last three to go. I might as well go ahead and do the ones that I've been to, just have not finished, I suppose. Oh, but I want to look around here first. Almost forgot. Um, since I already know where everything is. Oh, all the mighty stuff. Okay. Okay. What to keep, what to get rid of. This is tough. I could always come back here, though. I could leave it, come back. Whenever. And I think I might just do that. <laughs> you know what's sad? I was still thinking we were in the low gravity. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I did that. I'm dumb. All right. Yes, yes, I know what hurts. Definitely dumb because I just now realized what I need to do. Yeah. For the chest! Okay, cool. Zona equipment. Full suit. I really want to see what it do. I'm not entirely sure what the energy up. <laughs> oh, well, that's fine. Um, do that. just now remembered another thing I want to do in a little bit. My amber earrings are over here now. Um, like I said, let's go ahead and do these. It's been too long. So why didn't I finish these? Let's find out. Force. 
I remember this now. And I'm still confused on what I should be doing here. Okay. I can't use any zone eye devices, right? Yeah, I can't. But I can use these. But I can use what I have on me in materials. Yes. I don't know if this, this is probably not how I'm supposed to do it. a bit of weight on this now. Bop it. Just bop it. I'm not good with water physics. Okay. what I'm talking about when I say I can be dumb sometimes. That simple. Okay. I'm gonna take this with me just in case. <laughs> Maybe I can still use it. I'm also take the ball. I think 
have a basic construct I could get rid of. Yes. Ah, I brought the ball. Just good enough to let me through. Oh. I see what you want me to do. I refuse. I know exactly what it wants me to do. It wants me to use the ball to knock that loose, and then I can use the ball again, or even use the, uh, the whatchamacallit ability, the recall ability to make the platform go back up. I'll just ascend. I got ice fruit. <laughs> cool. So I remember why I said no to that one and came back. <laughs> I'm a little worried on why I said no to the other one now, because I really don't remember it. Uh, delete that. Let's find out. Sonapan. Did I say no and decide to come back? I'm gonna guess it might have been. Okay, it is not a fighting one then. I was thinking it was like a naked one where he has to do something. Missing pathways. Oh, did I really just say no to this? Oh, I did say no to this. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this one I can bring over. Put it here. don't know if this is a thing I can do. Okay. 
Should be plenty of time. Can I just walk in here? Can I wait? No. Oh! Oh, but I don't need to. I don't need to anyway. Oh, this is fine. I, I don't care about my album. Get me back up here. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I got this now, I got this now. Okay, the ones that gave me issues, not so bad anymore. <laughs> have more experience under me now. <laughs> Alright, one more then. I think. <laughs> Ooh, a gold apple. A couple gold apples. Oh, this is an apple orchard. I didn't even realize. That's nice. Oh no, they're angry orchards. Uh, I just need to go south from here. Let's just go. And I think I need to look for another cave. just be sitting out here, but I don't see anything. So I'm thinking it's still probably a cave somewhere. Oh yeah, it should be. Oh no, it's just... I need to find the crystal. Which looks like it's gonna be in a cave, because there's a the little guy there. There a cave underneath this. Usa Zoom Shrine. Yep, there's a cave there. And is this gonna point me into that cave? <sighs> yeah, I know. Find the stone. Grant me light that banishes evil. Light that banishes evil. Where is it? Yep. Cool, though. Another cave. Tory Mountain Foothill Cave. Oh, it's moving. Hinox has it, maybe? I don't have any arrows. Well, that'll be fun. Huh? Or maybe a huh? Stalnox. <laughs> Might not be a Hinox, but a Stalnox. Regardless, whatever it is, it can't be that bad. Eh, regular high knock. It's a basic high knocks. What are you laughing at? Yeah, basic high knocks. Doubt you'll do any damage to me. Yeah. Fall down. Another, yeah. But I don't have uh, any arrows. Which is fine because I have 
a boomerang, which is just as good, and I definitely know how to use it well. Okay, at least knocked him down. Oh, it did. Oh, okay, it did do him. Right, that's nice. I will say, little disappointed it does not uh, make a little tornado underneath the boomerang when I use it, like it did in Wind Waker, but it's fine, it's fine. Guess it's more like the boomerang from Ocarina of Time. Don't. It's all good. Oh, very nice. I'm gonna need that to buy the diamond circlet anyway. I need to do that. like anything else, so. Cool, not even an hour in, and now it was 152, and this will be it. Well, that's good. Again, don't know if I'm gonna get anything for it, but... Doesn't hurt to check and see. Final blessing for our Another mighty zone ice sphere. Plus six. What was this one? Doesn't really say. Yeah, I'll keep the one I have now. Yeah, it's the same. It's fine. Whatever. Alright. Once again, I'll leave it because it might say something different since this is the final one, I believe. The Shrine of Light, that which imprisons and purifies the ancient evil. You have done well to reach this place. We offer this light that will cleanse you of evil.
This is the final light of blessing. Good. Okay. Make your way to the Temple of Time. There you shall find a suitable reward for your efforts. So there is something. Tunica Tears. The Shrine Explorer. Tunica Tears is what I'm thinking. Because we have the Tunic of the Wild for Breath of the Wild. So Tunica Tears. Which is just going to be another tunic, which there's so many. <laughs> Maybe. It might also be a weapon. It might be another weapon. I don't know. It's a reward, so I'm assuming it's something decent. Alright, Temple of Time? Like the big Temple of Time or the little Temple of Time? Okay, this the one in the sky. Cool. Um, there is not really a good fast. I guess the this one. Been so long since I've been here. Oh, there's a chest behind it. Never mind. <laughs> well, I'll get my heart while I'm here anyway. Yes, the hot container. I shall grant the power you seek. I assume that's the last of the gloom in him, too. So we can't have two more heart containers. I'd have to take away two chunks of stamina in order to have full health. Lame. Ancient hero's aspect. Is that a chest piece? Gives 12 defense. This item said to contain the spirit of a hero who once saved Hyrule. That hero's aura will envelop the wearer. Cool. Okay, chest piece. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> well, I mean, it's definitely not a chest. <laughs> Is. That's supposed to be Raru? 
Did Raru have red hair? Raru does not have red hair. Unless this is old Raru. Who is this? Spirit of a hero who once saved Hyrule. Why does it look like it has Ganondorf hair? You know? Well, <laughs> what is this considered to then? Is it a headpiece? Uh, okay, it's either considered a head or a chest. Huh. Where is it in all this? It's at the very bottom here, okay. Okay, what do I get for upgrading this? I'm curious now. If I go in front of people with this, are they going to be afraid of me? Because this is definitely a species that no one in current Hyrule has ever seen. So if I just walk around Kakriko in this, am I just going to be scaring people like, ah, are they going to think I'm a monster? <laughs> Honestly, just looking at it like this, they look an awful lot like... Who are the the aliens in Avatar? What are they called again? They just look a lot like them, you know? At least to me, they look like it. Just, I mean, not blue, but like this. I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I'm totally wrong here. Bubon. <laughs> Maybe imagine perhaps because of the gloom. Mm -hmm. oh. Enhance. Mm -hmm. All the way down. Okay, I need more Hinox guts. So I can work on this then. Okay. I mean, okay. I still can't upgrade that. Gleok stuff. Ugh. Fun. I'm still missing Barbarian Head, wherever it is. The head piece and the leg pieces for rubber armor. I'm still missing pieces of just armor in general. Oh yeah, the phantom. There's other like phantom gear that I'm missing that I don't know. It can't be enhanced. Tingle's gear. I don't have the tingle feet. 
I don't have tingly feet. I think that's a that's an issue for some people. Trousers of the sky. I don't have any of the other sky gear. Oh, like the trousers of the hero and cap of the hero. Is this supposed to be the original hero from the very first Legend of Zelda? Do I have the stuff of the... Oh yeah, the wild gear is here. I just need scales off of each of the dragon and some acorns. Because acorns. Okay. Oh, thank you very much, Henderson, for following. I appreciate it. Thank you. Okadoke. Oh, <laughs> thank you, great fairy. So, if I want to upgrade this, which I kind of do in order to see what... Exactly if it gives a bonus. It is only one... It is only one piece of equipment, though, and those huh? don't tend to have any additional mm -hmm. effects, at least none that I've noticed. Huh? I'll still try just to see. Um, where was the zone eye gear? I want to see if I can upgrade those. I nearly forgot. Oh, there we go. I need more construct horns. Oh, flawless. So I need another ten construct. Captain Construct One Horns. More stuff I might do in my off... off time between streams. Again, if I do play this at all, and I'm not streaming, I don't do any kind of progress stuff. It's mainly just grinding away enemy parts to upgrade my equipment. Alright. Um, I did want to go back to Gerudo Town. I wanted to buy the diamond circlet. Because I forgot that's something that gives uh, attack boost. And my friend Hark said that it is very much worth uh, upgrading, so... I'ma do that. Also, I can see if people are weirded out by this. Savak. Savak. Uh -huh. Oh. Okay. They don't notice. They don't care. Hey! Hello, hello. Too frick. I want to sell <laughs> some stuff. Uh, oh. So I need 2,400. What do I have a lot of? I have a lot of bright bloom. Let's sell half of what I have. That alone will give me 600. There we go. Half. <laughs> Probably be handy for him. Um, I have a ton of blue bacoblin horns. I could sell that. They don't take the king scale? Mm. 
Intuition mm. says I should hang on to it. All right. Oh, let's sell half of those Alpha's talons for fifteen. Goodness. There we go. <laughs> Sometimes I forget I have so much monster parts on me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Just in case, I'll still hold on to some of these because I don't know what I'm going to need for <laughs> upgrades. Okay, what else have I not bought? I haven't bought the opal, which is supposed to be swim speed. Topaz earrings, good for shock resistance. I do want any piece oh. of gear I don't have yet. <laughs> Pretty proud of the quality on that. Make sure you put it to good use. This is just... Okay, I need to put on a diff different armor. Different armor. <laughs> put some pants on the Link. Dang it. Go with that. Gosh. Um. Uh, yes. Go with the opal ones, mm. even though I don't really need it. <laughs> Take oh. some more stuff. Huh. Huh. Oh. Um. I did have a lot of boss bacoblin fangs. And just regular Bacoblin. Let's go with half of the Bacoblin things. Let's go with this. <laughs> we'll sell 50 of these. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think there's anything else I really want to sell, or that I have a ton of. Yeah, nothing else I really have a ton of, like I did like some of the basic materials. Well, Moblin Fangs, Horribun Claws, I think I have a few of this Alpha stuff. Oh, no, I sold some of that, never mind. The Tails. Cleoc, that's... Uh, those sell for a lot. Same with the Lionel Guts, which makes sense. Because I'm going to need money still for the upgrades. Gosh darn it. I need the diamonds. I need my minerals. I definitely need those. Oh no, that's all I got for now. Alright. <laughs> It's easy enough to make money anyway. Ah, <laughs> uh, give me the topaz earrings. Uh. Uh. <laughs> Sark, personally guarantee. <sighs> that said, I really wish this O would stop standing on my precious wares. What? That said, I really wish this O would stop standing on my precious wares. What? Am I standing on? What is? I don't know what she's talking about on that. Standing on oh. her wares. <laughs> All right. It's all good, and now we get to go back to the Great Fairy because I need to see what these need to upgrade. I'm sorry. What else can I do? I'm done with shrines. I'm done with the roots. I guess check the quests, see if there's anything else kind of major I need to do. I know there's a side quest in, uh... Let's not do 
that. In Hebra, that... I eventually need to do. But for now, this is much more important. Alright. What I need for this diamond circle. Huh? Mm-hmm. Oh. Diamonds and flint. Hmm. I can give that away. So mm -hmm. four to seven. So only an additional three, which ain't much. Oh. Huh. Hmm. Seven to twelve. All right. Hmm. Yeah. Huh. Hmm. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. oh. Twelve to eighteen. Yeah, and see if some of these one-off kind of things don't give any kind of set bonuses. Mm -hmm. So I don't know if the aspect mm -hmm. thing would as well. I'll still look for some of the material <laughs> in order to do it, but not during stream. Not bad, 12 to 18. Oh. Oh. Mm. And I can. Oh, God, 8 and 2. 28. How much are my amber earrings? 28, which is my highest defense so far. Plus attack up? Hmm. Oh. Yes, please. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> it just looks like she's going to eat him. <laughs> All right, cool. Doesn't he look wonderful? Regular pants, a suit of soldier armor, and a diamond circlet upon his brow. Isn't he magnificent? <laughs> okay. Let's see some of the quests we can do. What do we got? The Fifth Sage. After meeting the owners of the mysterious voice, uh, report to Pura. Uh, just random stuff with this. Uh, we already know I have to Zelda, so pretty much talk to Pura for main quest stuff. I can go talk to Robbie. I managed to get the. 12 regions map, so I should be able to get a new medallion from him. We can fight in Akala. We can fight in Hebra. Oh, gosh. Oh, I do have a picture of this, so I can go back to Terrytown and get a King Gliok uh, figure made. I haven't done these yet. I still need to do pictures of the stone tablets. The side adventures don't seem too bad. I might do those. Don't need to worry about the shrines and then side. So side adventures and side quests. I feel like the side adventures might be important while the side quests not as much. Oh, yeah. Three secret hot springs guide the three waters to that place. When it fills, the slumbering treasure will awaken once more. I still think I need to make ice out of the 
in the hot springs and bring it to the center. Because I have no way... I have no clue how to get the water from each of those to the middle and whatnot, except make ice. <laughs> Oh, the Rito Rope Bridge. Check this out. Whirly swirly things. He wants a picture of the whirlpool in uh, Lake Hylia. Oh, he wants the picture. I do have that picture, I think, so I can I could go to that. Go to Gerudo Desert for that third fossil. Oh yeah, they want to race. So I need to go back to Terrytown anyway for the racers. I should be able to make this dish. I think I have the porgy, the rice, and the spice. Oh gosh, the wells. Ugh. Okay. That being said, let's go with the adventures right now. Let's go back to Terrytown, actually. Because we can do that and talk to the racers. See what's going on with that. Yeah. I have a feeling the King Gleok is the final picture that uh, they need. Knock on wood. And maybe the next time I stream this will be the finale for Tears of the Kingdom. My gosh. It's finally that time. Both exciting and a little sad. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Uh, was there anything I wanted to take off? I could make... Let's do that, actually. Break it down. This one. Do it. It's a better spear than it is than this sword is. Dang. Okay. Alright, y'all, I have what you need. Monster of them all! The King Gliak I've been in search of! Ooh. Now, this is a good picture. Nice detail. I can use it to make that sculpture no problem. <laughs> May we borrow it? Go ahead. Ooh. Yep, right. I'll get it built, son, and done. Mm -hmm. I'm so glad I don't need multiple, like, angles of it. I need to raise money for a house. Oh my god. 
Son and done as promised. Use my imagina I use my imagination to fill in the blanks. Ha yum! Magnificent. Yes, this is the mightiest of them all. The ultimate sculpture of an invincible monster. It's not invincible. It's not invincible though. It was nothing. Where are we gonna put this? I'll make a grin grow between my ears if we could select the perfect spot on the stage for the sculpture. Can I get it here? Without it falling? Okay, it won't fall. That works. That's perfect. Do it. Found a nice spot for it. What? <laughs> Behold, the king of the sky! Yeah, I'm glad I put him up there. Ah, to think th that we can stand here and hum beside such a thing. What a thrilling thrill for one to feel. Crafted with such good taste, too, I see. It's everything I hoped it would be. Ooh. I know it's a sculpture, of course, still. Even I'm surprised at how imposing it is. <laughs> yes, and now we must show it off to the eyeballs in the village. I don't know, I think this is going to scare people away. <laughs> hear ye, hear ye, come look-see! This is it, the most monstrous of all monsters, the King Gliok! But do not fear, draw near! This is the only place it's safe to admire such a monstrous royal up close. The only place! It is nothing sh- Oh, it's nothing short of astonishing. It has three, three heads! What would I do if I ran into something like this? I hope I never find out. Ahem! <laughs> <laughs> this sight has stolen your eyes. Now give me your ears, all of them! I say again, this monster is the fearsome King Gliok. Fire, ice, lightning, powers possessed by plenty of monsters, but our noble friend here is unique. It controls all three elements at the same time. And while it looks like a beast from a book of stories, I warn you not to dream of meeting it in the flesh. If you were to come face to triple face with such a monster, arriving home alive would be quite unlikely. Remember, please, reckless adventurers should beware and keep away. Aww. <laughs> Just seeing this one here is plenty frightening for me. <laughs> Look and learn, and then you won't hate. Understand what you fear, and you'll feel great. For those with an open mind, wonders always await. It's like a monstrous Willy Wonka. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you! Introducing the King Gliok to everyone! What an honor! Please allow me to reward you for all you've done. Thank you, I used up quite a bit. For me, there's nothing more valuable than the monster sculptures I've received. But I know gems are what most folks desire most. And here's the usual reward as well. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks to you, my dream is nearly complete! To build a collection of monsters to share with everyone, to show people that monsters are people too! <laughs> thank you, thank you! What exactly do you need now? Thanks to you, we keep bringing these wonderful monster sculptures to life! My delight is extreme! Ooh. I've got to admit, I'm feeling pretty inspired. If you have any other monster pictures, please show them to me. I'm happy to make all sorts of sculptures. <laughs> if you got monster pictures in your possession, Hudson can make more sculptures for me! So happy I will be! Check out this picture. I don't know if I have any really, but I'll... I can look through them as well. Uh, we've done these two... I don't know what that is. Uh, the horrible one I've done. That is just a regular electric Leoc. This is Shadow Ganon. Have I not done Shadow Ganon? Well, I just. Oh, the Gibdo. 
Oh, and the Moldoga. There's a few. First things first. <laughs> you have an artist's good taste. Can I borrow that picture? Go ahead. Ooh. Right, I'll get it up before you can say son and done. <laughs> Quick and quality, blink and you're done. That's why every son chooses hunts and construction. Gosh, son and done as promised. <laughs> this must be put on display too. Go ahead and decorate the stage as you see fit. <laughs> <laughs> Check out this picture. I want to get the Gibdo. Quick and quality. Blank done. Quickly running out of room for all these, you know. You're getting done in first. <laughs> Do it. It's just a bacoblin. Done, done with this then. The only other one is a Moldoga. <laughs> it being on its side. I just wanted to see it. Yeah, no. <laughs> We're done. Okay. Uh, which was the one where I could shop for a home? This one. Seven. Oh. Three th oh, 1,500. Oh. Okay, she won't let me sell stuff here. So I need another thousand. Still no, I wouldn't have enough even if I sold all those. Um Sixty-three 
three. Mm. And then we sell 50 of these. And then we have plenty of money. Uh. Plenty of money. Plenty of money. Mm. Fine. Plenty of money. I want the house, dang it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Ma. As I mentioned, we already have a prime plot of land set aside for you. It's a bit southeast of here. It has a... Uh, whoops. While it is a bit far away, there's a shrine over in that direction, okay? It has an excellent view, okay. Another member of our staff will meet you on the hill to the left of the shrine. Speak with him there for more details. <laughs> I hope you enjoy building your ideal dream home. Savork! Home on a range. Why do I suddenly have a bad feeling about this? <laughs> huh? It's up here, right? <laughs> I do like the music that's suddenly going now, though. The old shop theme from Ocarina of Time? Was this anywhere else? This can't be the first time I'm hearing it though, but I like it. Also, this is a big plot of land. Oh gosh. Whoa. Hey, hello, you must be Link. I'm Grantison of Hudson Construction. Rotson told me about you. I'm here to answer all your home building questions. In fact, why don't I get started with an overview of the process? First, if I could direct your attention this way. Ah. This is the plot of land you purchased. If you place the rooms we sell here, well, ah. you're on your way to building a one-of-a-kind dream home. Oh. Let's see. It looks like your contract includes two rooms. Mm. Excellent! Two rooms to get you started. Good choice. One moment, please. Ah. Oh, gosh. These are the rooms. The one on the left is a foyer. Foyer? 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 And the one on the right is a bedroom. They are covered with nets to protect the interiors, but don't worry, we'll remove them once construction is complete. Ah. Now all you need to do is place both rooms on the ground. Arrange the rooms so that they fit nicely within the rope boundaries. One more thing, you can only place rooms in the roped off area. Please remove any other items before the inspection. Mm. Now let me know when you're done so I can perform an inspection. With that, please thoroughly enjoy taking your first steps towards building your dream home. If no one else was able to do this, how the heck would they be able to build a home? You know? How do I want to do this for now? Mm. 
It's gonna be basic for now, I guess, until I get more rooms and stuff like that, so we'll just have it like this for now. Also put it here so we have more room in the back, and I assume I can move all these things around again when I start building. So, yeah, I think I'll go with this. Whoa. I'm done. I'll start the inspection right away. Ah. I didn't find any problems during the inspection. You're free to go inside. Uh -huh. You tell me that was your first time? Nice work. Your dream home is complete at last. So, mm. congratulations. Oh. I'll call Rudson over. Please wait here for just a moment. Oh. Sorry for the wait. How are things going? Are you happy with your investment? Of course, this is only the first step. The real building process begins now. <laughs> I hope you continue to explore building your dream home. After all, Hudson Construction sells a variety of room options. Speak with Gardison if you want to know more about them. This isn't much, but here's a little gift to celebrate starting your dream home. <laughs> Thank you. I'll be by your side for as long as it takes to build the home of your dreams. Why don't you take a look at the inside of the how of the rooms you placed? I do want to do that. <laughs> it is very basic right now. But you know what? It's mine. It's nice. I have a bed now. Free bed! How much? Once again, congratulations on having that construction project ah. done. Hope my introduction to the whole process was clear enough. After all, you can have so much more built. Maybe you'd like your home to have more of a comfort to home, or maybe some convenient features. Uh -huh. If you want to give any of that a try, don't tarry. Just talk to Gardison. That's me. At Hudson Construction, we offer a variety of customization options. Just buy a new room and remodel away. New rooms are an investment, which is why you can preview your options so you make the choice that's right for you. Now then, Ooh. do you have any construction requests? Well, you're in the right place. Mm. Okay, I got things ready. Just a moment, please. What do you have? Ah. Uh huh. I'm not quite ah. building it. I just want to see what you have. Oh. Need more rooms. Ah. Buy your preview Ooh. rooms. Angle furnished angled. Square furnished square. Oh, it's a dining. Weapon stand room. Bow stand, shield stand, gallery. We already have a bed, so I don't quite need the bedroom. Kitchen would be nice. Blessing room. I don't really need that. Paddock. Oh, for the horse! <gasps> the foyer, foyer. I, I don't know, man. Entrance or exits. Study. I'd like a study. Indoor stairs, outdoor stairs, garden pond. <gasps> Could be used without water depending on how it's placed. Flower beds. Rooftop garden. Oh, I like this. I might ah. do this more in my own time. <laughs> oh. I'm done for now. Mm. Thank you, though. Uh, that's actually really good to know. All right, cool. Ah. 
<laughs> I'll come back with more money. Ah, uh, that's so nice. Okay. Um, oh, the construction. I need to go to this construction site. For the races! I... I just want to kind of stand there and listen to that song. Because that brings me back. Hudson Construction. Oh, you're not the race person, are you? Ah! Uh, uh, I got whoa. it. Never mind. I, don't, I didn't mean to talk to you. There they are. They're over here. Yeah. Terrytown races ago. You're the traveler from before. I knew you couldn't stay away. Take a look at this. <laughs> With the help of Hudson Construction, we built a course for test driving vehicles. These runs will help us better research the steering stick's capabilities. So welcome to the Terrytown race. <laughs> With Tolly as our test driver, we spent a lot of time tinkering with the course designs. And we arrived at this masterpiece. Oh. Watching you drive the course was very informative. I'm grateful. Sarkso. Mm. Drivers have to use the steering stick we provide. It's the only way I can collect the data I need. As far as the vehicle itself, anything goes. Use whatever you like. Now, if you're up for it, I'd love to see you do some driving. Ah. While you're at it, why not spice things up with a little competition? Say, you versus Tali. She used to be called the Dame of the Dunes, you know. If you can beat her best time, well then, you win. <laughs> yeah, not a bad idea. Oh. Sounds fun, doesn't it? If I recall correctly, Tally's best time is two minutes exactly. So how about it? You want to see if you can beat Tally's record? Of course. Yeah. Woohoo! I apologize, I get excited, and I can't help but woo and hoo when I get excited. <laughs> Once you're ready the vehicle you plan to use in the race, go ahead and attach the steering stick we provided. Oh? Since you're helping us collect data, any zone I device or building material you find around here is yours to use. Just let me know when everything is ready. Find something like this. Oh gosh, no. These will be speedy, and this will be able to get me up where I need to go, but... These wouldn't. I'd be able to get started to go up, but... I don't know. I don't know, no, no, no. I guess it just depends on the course. How the course is gonna go. Let's try this. I want to see how it does. It's probably not going to be great, but... Okay, I'm ready to... I 
Also, I want the rocket. Put the rocket. You know what? I don't think it's going to do that much. Or else I'll put on a couple fans. This is dumb. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> oh yes, the vehicle looks good. Oh. Ready to begin? Of yeah. course. Two minutes. Touch all the lights, return to the starting point. Don't take your hands off the steering stick once you grabbed it or go too far off course now. On your mark. Oh gosh. Actually, okay. Oh, almost a minute exactly. Ah. Ooh. I can't believe it. You actually broke Tali's record. Yeah, this is my way of thanking you for helping us collect so much valuable race data. Thanks. <laughs> Who'd have thought a Vo could race like that? All right, I'll say it. That was some brilliant driving. Oh. Your mastery of the steering stick was impressive. Well done. Well, 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 how about that? It's not often Tali has so much to say. Seems like her next great rival rivalry has begun. I'm honored to witness the beginning. Eh. After saying how you prioritize your racing line, I feel like you're ready for something a bit more challenging. You and I should talk. Come see me later, will you? Alright. Now... <laughs> Operating expenses for this Terrytown races are a bit tight, so, uh, you need money. Ah. We're now going to charge an entry fee of 10 rupees per run. Exciting news, isn't it? Thrilling, even. Yes? No? Sorry. Perhaps exciting is the wrong word. It is a difficult announcement to make, and I can see that giving it a cheery spin did not help. Whoa. But still, we have the ex the expert course, which I believe is worth trying, even if you do have a, to pay a fee. And of course, I'll reward you if we're able to get good data. So I'm confident the experience will be well worth the 10 rupees. Fine. Mm. That's what I like to hear. You want to use a vehicle of yours as is, or would you like to make some... I'll make an adjustment. Oh. Yeah, I want the... Uh, I want more rockets. Oh, is that the only rocket? Do I have any on me? I don't think I do. That's fine. We'll go as is. You know what? It's fine. We'll go as is. Expert course. Uh Hopefully it's not too bad. Oi. 
three minutes. Touch each and every light and get back here before the timer runs. Don't let go of the steering stick. Don't go too far off course. I don't think I can go that fast to get off course. Unless I'm just not paying attention. I was glad I have enough charge for this, you know? Oh, you jerk. I might not make it. Oh no. Big charges. We got this. Long as I can get back up there, which is gonna be the fun part. All right, we got it. New record. Just under two minutes. Congratulations! I can't believe you cleared the expert course. I should have expected as much from a Vo Tali respects. Here, please. I want you to have this memento for being the expert course for the first time. Thanks, I just mm -hmm. used one. What are you gonna do now? Feel like giving it another go? Not interested. Please come back and drive it again sometime. Finally, a worthy rival. Saba Saba! <laughs> skill the expert course was difficult even for me I did not expect you to complete it and beat my time so easily oh. it's a lot I can learn from studying your technique and as long as you're here surely the research can continue without issue Shabon and I should be free to leave I must continue to refine my technique mm. should I reevaluate reevaluate how I train my body or do I need to reconsider how I plan my run of a, on a course I want to talk to you uh. hold on don't go leaving me out of the conversation. Mm -hmm. Something you want to ask? What's this all about? This isn't the place to talk. Why don't we go somewhere more relaxing? Like where? This is more relaxing? I see. So it's a race that takes place on the water. Right there off the Lurland Village shore. But racing on the ocean? I don't know. Sounds difficult. Maybe even impossible. Mm -hmm. No. That is not true, Shabon. Racing in a place where there are no roads? Racing on the ocean? No, it is not impossible. Oh. The possibilities are endless! Ah. Well, 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 Tali. You're all fired up. But I don't know what to do here. If we just up and leave this construction site... Construction site? Construction site? We'll be leaving Furnison in a lurch. Ah! I'll be just fine. I was able to get the data I needed thanks to the both of you, and this one here too. <laughs> Go and help him out, and don't worry about me. Building a race course on the water sounds like fun. I wouldn't want you to miss out. Though, if you don't mind, could you gather some data from the waterfaring vehicles? Wait. That's a kind offer, Sarkso. I'm willing to bet you'll need a lots of equipment to get the water rally up and running, so please take any Zonai devices or building materials you think you'll need from here. Ah! Sarkso, you know, when this project started, I was sure we'd gotten the bad end of the bargain. But nah, this is fun. Oh. It was a valuable experience indeed. I thank you. Ah! No, thank you. 
Oh, thank you very much, Albert. Albert Lana. Hello. How are you doing today? Hey, did my racing. <laughs> Things are quieter around here now. I'm glad I sent them off with a smile, but the truth is, I'd still like to get more data. <laughs> well, you'll get more data once, uh... We do the Lurlin races. Alright, what were some more of the main side adventures? Oh yeah, go talk to Robbie. Take photos of the tablet still. And just help out in Akala and Hebra. Cool. Let's do Robbie's stuff next. I'm doing not too bad. Not too bad at all. Thank you for asking. I'm from the U.S. United States. Uh, more specifically in Illinois. Uh, Robbie, where are you? There you are. Hey! Hey, you! We have more work to do. Your Purapad is nowhere near its full capability yet. <laughs> so which feature do you want to add? Travel and alien. What?! You have that map data already? And for 15 areas? In that case, I'll add the ability to travel to a second and third spot with the travel medallion feature. <laughs> I knew you could do it. Great work. Come on, let me see that parapad. Whoa. Now, give me just a moment. Travel medallion. This mysterious tool was built by Robbie. Place it by opening your inventory and registering your current location as a travel gate. And here's a third spot for your travel medallion feature. Second verse, same as the first. Unbelievable! With that, I've fully upgraded the travel medallion feature. Consider it a great honor. Awarded to you for your extensive travels. Hey, and now... Am I done with you, Robbie? <sighs> Completed! At last, your Pura Pad is perfect. And that means <sighs> you are perfect. That is the objective truth, I'm very pleased to say. Because with all of that, you'll make infinitely better progress in your search for Princess Zelda. Now... When you find Princess Zelda, <laughs> be sure to tell her you couldn't have done it without my pur pad improvements. No problem, Robbie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I've not been streaming for too long. About a year now. Give or take. Okay, so that's taken care of. Let's go ahead and do the Akala. Monster fighting. Uh, we'll go from here, but I won't actually use the tower. What's my favorite game? Oh, gosh. I don't know. That changes throughout the weeks, days, months. That can change at the drop of a hat for me. My favorite genres are RPGs, but... My favorite game... It's one that is just something I go back to a lot. Hmm. 
my full-time streamer? I mean, I try to stream most days, every day is at a set time. Mm, throughout the week, Monday through at least Thursday, I try to stream from about 2 to 5-ish, depending on if I'm busy or got things to do. I tend to also stream over on the weekends and the mornings because I tend to work throughout the weeks normally. Monday through Friday anyway, with the weekends off of course. What am I seeing there? Oh, that's what I know, thank you. No, I want to talk to Butter. Huh. Welcome back. It's only natural you would dream of my cooking as night falls. Captain Torn Squad is now leading a dangerous and important strike. Mind that curiosity doesn't get you involved. Where are they at? Ah. Akala's span is down the road from here. The squad's mission is to strike at the monsters that have taken it over. <laughs> it was your appetite that brought you here, yeah? How are they? Have some other... I can't speak. Have some of this. It's one of my specialties. Tough prime meat and seafood fry. Grants a low-level defense boost. This comfort dish is made with choice cuts of meat and seafood. Mm. I've heard that they're dealing with some troublesome foes. I can only pray they'll be alright. Let's go check. I will probably... Stop streaming in a bit. I do have to jump off and get some stuff done before too long. So this will probably be my last quest for today, at least. We shall see, though. Hey, Torin. <laughs> well, if it isn't Link, you came to our aid again. I'm so happy and also incredibly grateful. Ooh. As you can see, we're in the midst of preparing to attack the monsters who dug it, a who dug in up ahead. They must be wiped out. Just like last time, we'll approach the fields, the fiend's stronghold first, then launch our attack when the moment is right. <laughs> if you're so inclined, Link, perhaps we can fight together again and drive out those hideous monsters. Let's do it! Hmm? Charge! <laughs> Oh gosh, there's quite a few silver foes. I still have no arrows, so... Oh, no, 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 no. That's fine. I can knock him off the bridge. No, I'm not going to be able to. Oh, well, that worked. Anything else? Where else? Oh. I'm losing materials, but that's fine. <laughs> we did it! That was the very last one. We won! Everyone fought so bravely. Thank you for your help, Link. If you don't mind, can I have a moment of your time? Sure, sure. <laughs> I can't thank you enough for doing so much on our behalf. Sometimes it feels like you're the real monster control crew. I'm sorry if this has been a burden for you. Here, please take this token of my appreciation for everything you've done. I'll take it. I'm thinking of giving the team a bit of a break. The Blood Moon. I'm sure you've noticed it. When the sky turns crimson, the monsters rise up from the depths of the underworld. We should all rest when we can... when we can... S we should all rest when we can, so we have the energy to fight these endless battles. Link, if you were by our side, I'm sure we'd be safe, but I probably shouldn't burden you with that. With that, it's time for me to go. I hope we meet on the battlefield again someday. <laughs> May the goddess highly always protect you, brave swordsman. Do 
have Discord? I do, but I tend to only really use it for uh, voice chat with uh, my friends Hark and Rabbit. Alright. I think I'm gonna call it there for now. Stream for two hours. That should be good for now. Thank y'all for watching. Um, I should be able to be on tomorrow, and tomorrow I'll play some more of Pikmin 4. I don't know if I'm going to be able to Thursday, but I think I should. Friday is up in the air. I might be doing a multiplayer game with Hark and Rabbit, though. That's not always the case. If we're busy, probably not. But if we do, it's probably going to be Hunt Showdown again. Although Rabbit has been saying that she wants to play the new Dokapon Kingdom for Switch, so we might also do that. We'll see. Um, this weekend, this Saturday, more of this, maybe the finale. I might do some stuff on my own, if y'all don't mind. Mainly the, uh... I was thinking maybe the, some of the side quests, but I don't know. I might, on my own, kind of just search the caverns and such. Search for just where some of the uh, loose articles of uh, armor and stuff that I've not found. Just see if I can go into some caves and do that. Spelunking! Ha! Um, and of course, Sunday, Pikmin 4. Yeah. Sorry, wasn't paying attention to the chat. Uh, yeah, I use Twitter. I chat with people on Twitter sometimes. And, of course, I post whenever I'm getting ready to stream and everything on there, too. I have the link to my Twitter below. As, all, as well as links to Hark and Rabbit's channels, too, if people are interested in looking at those. And you can also ask a question. I don't mind. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and save. Sort my stuff there. Sort. I have a free spot here. I do want to buy a weapon stand for my house. I want to put some of these other weapons that I have in there, like, <clears throat> I want to put the Sword of the Hero in there, I want to put the White Sword of the Sky in there, pretty much the lower attack level weapons that are still nice, the boomerang probably. You're doing great work, and you have all skills to grow your channel, but you don't get grow growing your channel. I don't want to hurt you, but I know something that's missing in your channel. Um, I know that my channel's not increasing a whole lot. Day by day, I get a follower here and there, which I am grateful for. I'm not extremely prioritizing growth that much. I, again, appreciate those that want to follow me. I know that I have quite a few... The, the platform itself is super saturated with all kinds of content creators. And I know out of all of those, I am quite lacking. I understand that. I'm just kind of going at things my own pace right now. Um, 
And I know, I don't really have a webcam, I don't have any kind of special displays or anything. I am eventually getting help with that from my friends Hark and Rabbit. Rabbit's helping me with more of the, uh, the, um, oh, whatchamacallit, not display, but the whole kind of the streaming setup that I got going. And Hark is helping me come up with a new kind of little avatar that I think is like really cute and wanting to use on here eventually because again I don't have really a webcam right now and eventually I'm probably going to get one and I will show my face to the world but I'm not quite ready for that yet anyway <laughs> I mean, you you can do what you want in your own time, I mean. So you use model? Right now I'm not, but my friend Hark is planning and starting on making one for me, which, again, is something that I'm planning on using. But if you want to make things on your own, like, that's fine. I probably, myself, I'm not going to ask anyone to make me anything, like, right now. Again, I'm not planning on really uh, using anything like that. I'm planning on using uh, Harks and Rabbits because they offered it and they're my friends. <laughs> And I appreciate them doing that. But I'm not at all expecting viewers or anyone to do that for me at all. If it's something that you want to do for you, just as something you want to do, go for it. Definitely. I wouldn't say not to. Like, kind of fan kind of stuff. <laughs> but I can't, like, I don't feel comfortable with uh, using anything like that right now. <laughs> Thank you, though, <laughs> if that was what you were getting at. I don't know if that is, but if it was, yeah. <laughs> Thank you, though, <laughs> if so. All right. I need to jump off right now, though, so thank you all for watching. Thank you, Albert, for chatting with me and for following. Again, if uh, you decide you don't want to because of anything that I might have mentioned or said, like, that's fine. You don't have to, again. It's, I appreciate it either way, just chatting or interacting. It's always nice. Um, I had another follower just now. I wish it would kind of uh, keep track of something like that. I do have a way of finding out who that was, but it takes me a second. And I want to thank you, thank that person again. It was Henderson. Henderson, thank you again for following earlier. I do appreciate it. <laughs> but yeah, this is how I tend to stream, you know? <laughs> and things will slowly but steadily change hopefully get better <laughs> we'll see but yeah for now thank y'all for watching um check the schedules to make sure like when i'm streaming and everything in general and yeah uh i hope y'all have a great rest of your day bye